I left the dealer alone. I probably would have satiated my growing thirst if it weren't for all those goddamn orphans at my back and him telling the truth and all. I sure had love for the kids, though. They were like me. They weren't afraid of anything. They followed me back outside. Kel wasn't here, and I was feeling ashamed. They knew I had taken the thief. They saw the powers I had. And wasn't that murder? You can't hide anything from a kid. It's awful good, though, how they read you. Makes you feel kind of stripped out there, surrounded by all these inquisitive children and the truth. The orphans, these ones, made you even more transparent. They were downright evil about discovering you under all your hats because they weren't sheltered from the storms of life. They knew all about things your average kid couldn't understand. There was no getting over on Gaptooth. He had my number. He knew I had dark ways about me. He was scared of me, but knew I could and would protect him in a heartbeat. He just liked to get close to me. I was some sort of hero to him. Wow, maybe it was the protection spell, pulling his earlobes. He remembered all right. He wished he had some power too, helpless as he was, small in the world. These kids weren't pushovers. They all wanted the power to take vengeance on those who abused them. The boys did, at least. Yes, they knew I had done in the thief, and they loved it. A man who had never shown them an ounce of kindness, but had them stealing for him and pickpocketing tourists in Jacqueline and Square, and gave them a thrashing if they came home with nothing to show. Unwittingly, I had liberated them from him. I felt like one of a cast of characters in a modern-day Oliver Twist. I better not hang around these kids too long. I certainly wasn't interested in being anyone's object of devotion. They would make trading cards out of me, pushing me up against a stick of powdered bubblegum, wrap me in plastic, the deluxe series. Kids would wear Freddy and Hendrix masks for Halloween, and plastic replicas of our amulets. They would turn our spells into recipes. Oh, no. I gave them some money to go away. Go and get some hot chocolate, little ones. Run along.